Full race cards and selections for every weekend and every day of major horse racing festivals are on our website at ulo.co.uk. It's the Guineas weekend at Irish headquarters, the Curra, with the 2000 Guineas Saturdays highlight, and Charlie Appleby's native trail is sure to be the one on the top of the perch, after only losing out to smart stablemate Corobus in the new market version of the classic. However, Joseph O'Brien's Buckaroo is a course and distance winner and might cause an upset in the feature. Across the Irish Sea, at the Merseyside track Haydock Park, Winter Power can land the Group 2 Temple Stakes. She's the fastest thing on four legs on her day, and although her best efforts come at York, she should be suited to this track, and is one to keep on side. Down on the south coast, Lone Eagle should score at Goodwood in the listed Tapster Stakes, where his neck second to the very smart Hurricane Lane in the Irish Derby last year showed his class. This listed contest on a course where he has winning form should be just the ticket to get this season underway. Back at the Curra, Aidan O'Brien's Blackbeard can land the first of the pattern races on the Guineas card, the Marble Hill, while a case of you should be the one to follow in the Greenland stakes. But, it's later in the day, and a trip down to Paris to find our Saturday nap, Classical Dream, who lines up in the champion hurdle. He put his mid-division finish in the Stayers hurdle at the Cheltenham Festival well behind him when landing the same event at the Punchestown Festival last month, never in doubt. He takes on course specialist Lautonomy, who carries one of the highest ratings in training, but that supermare gets stretched by this trip. Classical dream to continue Willie Mullen's excellent year. Earlier in the day, back up at Haydock Park, our next best is the exciting Go Bears Go. Good enough to feature in the Breeders' Cup Juvenile Turf Sprint at Del Mar, where the only horse to beat him was the electric Twilight Gleaming, David Lochnane's charge showed he's got a big campaign ahead of him when scoring in the Group 3 Commonwealth Trial Stakes at Ascot. Having taken the trial, he'll be high on the shortlist for that Royal Ascot date, but can land this on his way there with conditions to suit.